Rottweiler Lab Mix, what to know about this stunning family dog. The Rottweiler Lab Mix has taken the world by storm. These excitable dogs are not for the first time dog owner given their hyperactive and stubborn nature. Despite that these dogs do fit into most households. As long as you are willing to put in the time to physically exercise them they can excel anywhere. Interested in learning more about this athletic and muscular dog? Watch on to learn more about how to properly care for these beautiful dogs. Before going into the video, you need to grab the free dog training secrets guide in which we have disclosed the deepest dog training secrets that professional dog trainers don't want you to know about. These training secrets would help you have a well-behaved, super intelligent, smart, and obedient dog without spending hundreds of dollars. So make sure to check the first link in our description to the free video series guide. Now let's get into today's video. What is a Rottweiler Lab Mix? Overview. A mix between a purebred Labrador and Rottweiler, the origins of the Rottweiler Labrador mix remain unknown. It is thought that they were originally developed sometime in the United States during the 1990s. Although they were developed as a companion, they are an athletic and agile dog that can be used as more than just a pet. They excel at dog sports such as agility or rally. They also make excellent hiking companions, pretty much anything you may want to do, these dogs are willing. Their easygoing temperament also means that they fit into most households, from homes with children or without children, to apartment living or living in the country. Overview, Mixed Breed, Rottweiler slash Labrador. Purpose, Companion. Weight, 70 to 115 pounds. Size, 24 to 27 inches. Temperament, Loyal, Energetic and Confident. Pros and Cons. Pros. Great with children. Very playful and happy does not require a lot of grooming, can make good watchdogs, adaptable and can live in most households. Cons. Can be difficult to train. Their strength can make them hard to control. Not good with strangers. Victim of breed bans. Rottweiler lab mix appearance. Because this is a mixed breed, their physical appearance will vary depending on which parent breed the puppy takes after more. In general Labradors are thinner than Rottweiler, so Rottweiler lab mixes will fall somewhere in the middle of these two breeds. Both breeds are broad-shouldered with a slight tuck and a large head. The first thing that you should notice with the Rottweiler lab mix is how athletic they are. They should look muscular and give off a commanding presence. Their body usually resembles a Rottweiler, but their head and longer muzzle has more resemblance to the Labrador. Size The typical size of one of these dogs is anywhere between 24 to 27 inches in height, with a weight of around 70 to 115 pounds. Remember those pups with more Labrador will be on the smaller side, whilst those with more Rottweiler are on the heavier side. Coat and Colors These dogs come in a handful of darker colors including brown, black, gray or black and tan. A black and tan coat like that of a Rottweiler is the most common. The short to medium length coat of a Rottweiler lab mix should be smooth to the touch. Because they have a double coat, these dogs shed quite a bit. To keep up with their shedding you should expect to brush your dog every other day or at the very least, weekly to keep the coat healthy. 5 Fun Facts About Lab Rottweiler Mixes Rottweiler Lab Mixes are also known as Rottadors, Labrati, Labweilers, and Rotten Labs. They are one of the largest hybrid dogs around. Despite the short coat these dogs are not hypoallergenic. This is a very adaptable dog and is suitable for most households. They are recognized by the Dog Registry of America but not the AKC. Rottweiler Lab Mix Personality and Temperament Rottweilers and Labradors vary quite a bit in their personalities, so it can be difficult to predict exactly how your mix will behave when fully grown. One thing you can know for sure is they love to be with their family. They will follow you all over the house and are happiest when they can be by your side. Because of this they are often prone to separation anxiety, so please be ready to work through this with your new dog. These dogs tend to be very playful and love nothing more than to play a game of fetch or tug with their owner or other dogs. And like working labs they have boundless amounts of energy meaning that they will play for hours. Rottweiler and lab mixes are a protective breed but are not typically aggressive, still caution is needed when letting your dog interact with strangers. Proper socialization when they are young can help to curb this but they will most likely never be very welcoming of strangers. Is the Rottweiler lab mix a good family dog? Both Rottweilers and Labradors make great family dogs so expect this mix to be no different. They are more than willing to participate in any antics that their kids get up to. Just remember these mixes are protective by nature and will often view other children as a threat to their own kids. Caring for a Rottweiler Lab Mix The Rottweiler Lab Mix is a highly active, very strong breed that needs discipline and a strong owner. 
They require obedience training from day one to make sure that you can keep control of them when they grow bigger and stronger. Other than that they do great in almost any household. They are a very adaptable dog that do not bark much. The biggest issue with this breed is the huge amount of physical exercise they need. Exercise requirements. Both the Labrador and the Rottweiler are high energy and athletic breeds, so your mix will be the same. These dogs like to go and need a lot of daily exercise. At least one hour walk a day with another hour of play time is the bare minimum required for these dogs. Hiking or even swimming are great ways to tire out your dog physically. So make sure that you have the time to take them for an extra hard hike at least once a week. You can also do dog sports with your Rottweiler Labrador mix, such as agility and rally. Anything that works your dog's body is good. If these dogs do not receive the proper amount of physical stimulation they can become destructive. Number of walks per day, 2. Total exercise needed per day, 120 plus minutes. Grooming and shedding. Because of their short coat these dogs do not require regular trips to the groomers or daily brushing. However they do need to be brushed every other day or so. Regular bathing is also not necessary for these dogs. You can give them a bath just when they smell or look like they need it. Too many baths can dry out their fur and cause skin irritation. To remove dead hair and skin you can also use a wet washcloth and wipe it over their body. Feeding and Diet A high protein food specialized for large breed dogs is best for your mix. You should speak with your vet to establish the protein content your pooch needs, it differs depending on how active your dog is. Because the Rottweiler lab mix is prone to bloat it is best to feed this dog in smaller portions throughout the day. Giving them a cup of food three times a day is best. Never leave food out freely for this breed, they are prone to being overweight. Calories per day, 1700. Cups of kibble per day, 3. Known health problems. Some problems that Rottweiler lab mixes are prone to include ear infections, allergies, cold tail, bloat and obesity. If you're like most dog parents, or parents-to-be, you care for your pet immensely. Having pet insurance could save you from potential headaches of going to the vets with reimbursement for every vet bill from now on. Save massively on your pet's medical costs whether it's an illness, injury, or wellness expense that needs taken care of. Always keep an eye on your dog for any signs of abnormal behavior so you can catch these issues early. A lot of these issues can be avoided with tested parents, and the right dog food and exercise. How long does a Rottweiler lab mix live? As this is a mix it can be hard to predict exactly how long they will live. Both Labradors and Rottweilers have fairly long lifespans so expect your mix to live for about 9 to 12 years. How much does a Rottweiler lab mix cost? You can expect a Rottweiler lab mix puppy to cost around $600. How to train a Labrador? Both the Rottweiler and the Labrador are eager to please and highly intelligent breeds, meaning that the Rottweiler lab mix gets these excellent qualities too. They respond best to positive reinforcement and thrive with repetition. However, you should keep any repetition short, only do about 5 to 7 repeated exercises before moving on to the next. Socialization with strangers is the most important thing for this dog. Even with proper socialization the Rottweiler lab mix can still be standoffish with strangers. While some dogs need a lot of mental stimulation these dogs do not. They do however need lots of physical stimulation so be prepared to play a lot of games. These dogs love games of fetch or tug. If you are interested in doing dog sports they excel at agility and rally. The Rottweiler lab mix does great in most households and is a very adaptable dog. They do better in homes with active owners and older children. However because of their sometimes stubborn nature and how big they are, these dogs are not recommended for first time owners. Lab Rottweiler mixes are loyal, protective and playful balls of energy. They require a lot of daily physical stimulation to keep them in shape and from becoming destructive. Overall they are a fairly easy breed to take care of. The biggest thing to worry about is how big they grow, and making sure they get enough socialization and exercise. And don't forget to check out the free video series that teaches the quick and easy way to an obedient dog, so make sure to get yours by clicking the first link in the description. If you like the video then make sure to hit that like button. Also if you want more dog training, guides, information then make sure to subscribe to our channel. Let me know what you think of this video in the comments and thank you for watching. And please consider subscribing our channel for more about dog training and dog breeds content every day.